Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So you guys, are hope, I hope you're having a great start to your weekend. Um, I'm here just checking the energy, right? Uh, seeing what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Anyway, just take what resonates, leave the rest behind, right? Don't try to force anything. And thank you so much. I love you guys. Thank you for all of the support. I really do mean that. You guys are my peeps out here. Um, I just get so happy, you know, when I get to come online here and um, sit with you for a while, you know. Thank you. I love you. This Soul Tribe rocks, man. All right, so Spirit, what messages do you have for my beautiful collective? And I'm going to be having a Valentine's Day giveaway. I already got the decks in, you guys. They're awesome. Um, so, you know, stay tuned to the channel. I'm going to be now I'm going to be showing you those decks here in the next probably the next week, you know. Anyway, spirit, what messages do you have for my beautiful collective? Okay. Ooh, boy. Okay, so um here's the thing. There's a masculine here who has been in denial of this connection, okay? This is a twin flame soulmate connection. <laughs> um, it's this is a twin flame card, and uh, I feel like they can't resist the pull of it. They can't seem to forget about you. They can't shake you. This person tried to deny this connection, and they started a family with somebody else. They got into a commitment, thinking that they could forget about you, and they can't. Okay, look, they can't. They've got, they're about actually ready to pop up on you, okay? Um, this person, they're hooked, and they realize that they're in love with you. You're the only one that they actually have desire for, okay? Even though they started a family with somebody else. There could even be somebody who's pregnant right now, knowing that they're about to, well, it says here the divorce is final, but they may be um, wanting some financial help from this person so they may have to give like alimony child support but I feel like that these two are either breaking up or they have already broken up and your person wants to come forward yeah look child support alimony is on the bottom of the deck yeah they are realizing they want to they want you okay this person they know they're certain that one thing is for sure in all of this this person knows they're in love with you because honestly, th this whole time they haven't been able to stop thinking about you. They're absolutely focused on you, fascinated by whatever it is that you're doing. Okay? Um, and I do feel like it's over for this other situation that they were in. You know, I feel like this person did try. They actually honestly tried to forget about you, Collective, and they can't. <laughs> They're getting ready to come forward and talk to you, okay? They want to get on the same page. They want to know if there's a chance, okay? Is there a chance? Because right now, you're in this energy where you're moving on. Um, you've had enough, you know? You're turning your back. You're elevating. You're upgrading. You could even be making a house move, a location change, a job change. Something for you is changing here. And you're leveling up. Okay? You're ascending. You may even be feeling this person kind of pulling on your energy right now. Because of this connection and because they're so focused on you. They know you're moving on. And they want to get back together. This is a, a twin flame soulmate connection. Now this person, I feel like, yep, here they, they want to come back around. Um, hold on a second. Something fell on the floor. Sorry, that was my bad, you guys. Um, yeah, I feel like this person wants to come back in kind of begging. They may even be very emotional because they know that you're moving, you're moving on with your life. You know? I mean, this is really the only place in this reading where your energy is. And you've got your back turned and you're moving on here. Okay? This person could be having a, an awakening. I feel like they already have, though. 
They already know that you're the one that they want. They are about to come forward. You're about to get an unexpected uh, visit from this person. This is somebody who um, tossed you aside, you know? Yeah, like, and I was just about to say that. They tossed you aside like you were garbage. And they tried to, um, they tried to forget about you. But this person, they were in a karmic situation and they've learned their lesson. I feel like they put you in a third party, you know? They left you behind feeling used. Yeah, they've been with a karmic this whole time. And that's why these karmic situations, you guys, they're over. You know, it may take some time to actually do the cleanup, but there, these the karmic situations are coming to an end. The cycle's over already, okay? So people are getting their karma. They're, there's a lot of separations that are happening right now, all right? And your person, they, this person has learned. They're coming in to talk to you. They're hoping and praying that this goes down well. You could be seeing a lot of um, signs, synchronicities, right? Repetitive numbers. But this infinity sign, that's telling me that this person's coming back around. Okay? Yeah. They're on the verge to confess. They are on the verge of confessing, about to reveal how they feel about you. This could even be going down today. So I'm getting the sense that this person may even pop up at your house today for someone. Okay. So maybe be expecting a pop-up surprise visit. I don't know how you could be expecting an unexpected visit, but you're like, uh-uh, Becca, I am done. I've learned my lessons too from this person. I've completed a cycle. You know, I feel like you may not want to see this person again. At one point, I feel like you did. I feel like at one point, you were wishing and hoping for this person to come back around or um, make things right with you and apologize. Okay, but now that you're elevating, that you're moving on and you've healed, uh, you really truly do feel done with this. Like... Um, you or this could be something that, you know, like I said, you're not expecting, right? You may think this is over, but it's not over. It was never over. Um, that's uh, Noah from the movie The Notebook. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, this isn't over yet. This person is about to come back around, collective. They're in love with you. I don't know what else to say. They're in love with you, okay? undeniably, irrec irrecoverably in love with you. That's from um, Twilight. They just know that um, you're the one that they, they want. You know, it's like they, this person is turning around and literally running back to you. And I feel like they may even come today. You know, whoever they left behind... This person is feeling threatened, embarrassed, or about to be because I feel like um, whoever this karmic is that they chose over you, okay, uh, she's going to want some kind of revenge once she finds out this masculine is coming back to you. Right now, she seems pretty quiet. Everything seems quiet, doesn't it? <laughs> You know, you know, when everything seems quiet, what do you think is going to happen? Something, something big. And I feel like that's what this is. Yeah, it's almost time to here comes your person racing towards you. Okay, I feel like they were the runner. They tried to deny this. They tried to avoid this, but they can't anymore. This person adores you. They admire you. They're in love with you. And they're, they're going to start chasing you, okay? <laughs> you know, I feel like they've been pretending, right? They've been pretending um, that they don't feel something for you for too long. They can't do it anymore. So 
yeah, get ready for this person to want to come in and communicate. All right, let's see how they're feeling. What else can you show us, spirit? Yeah, but um, keep in mind, though, this karmic, I, I feel like it's a karmic individual. Okay, maybe she tried to trap your person in with the pregnancy. Those two, it's over with them. It may seem quiet right now. I feel like there's been a pause. Um, but now, <sighs> things are about to start moving and shaking, collective. Okay, so, yeah, what can you show me? Yeah, your person, right, they're sitting here watching time tick by. They can't do this anymore. Uh, this person's uninterested in anything else going on around them. They're only thinking about you, you know? So, yeah, they have been resisting this, but I feel like, um, oh, and they're also, you know, what's underneath that is this. Here's the thing. I feel like they're, they're not speaking to the karmic right now. They don't, they're trying to avoid the karmic now, and they're racing towards you. Stressed out. This person is stressed out because they broke your trust. They may not think that they have any chance with you again, and I feel like they're angry, but what they did to you was brutal. Um, I feel like they put you through a lot of public uh, public humiliation is what this feels like. Humiliation, embarrassment, they people turned against you and you were innocent in this. Like I, I feel like as you stand here, you're like, why are all of these people doing this to me? They could have had people trash talking your name. So you know what? You left all of that behind. You're moving on here. And leaving this person behind and they're freaking out about it. So this is why they're coming in really fast. Okay? Like really fast. Like today. Um, where's that today card? Like today collective. So someone's going to hear from this person. And what did I say? What did I say? Someone's going to hear from this person today. I feel like they're going to show up. They may even bring you a gift. Okay? They may get some kind of reassurance from a friend, too, in order to get the strength to come in. They may be finding out that you could also be meeting somebody new in the future here, and that's making them very angry, very upset. So, yeah, this person doesn't want you to get away. They don't want you to leave their life. Uh, they're in love with you, collective, all right? They've been denying it, but it's true. And I feel like there's a very resentful person up here. That's this karmic. I feel like they're worried that you two are going to get back together. I can also see this as your person being worried that you're still angry with them. And possibly resentful. No, I feel like it's the karmic. The karmic is really worried now. Now that your person is free from that karmic situation, she's worried that, that you two are going to get back together. Thank you, Divine. Okay. Wow. So get ready because um, she's right. Uh, this person is coming in for union. But the choice is going to be yours, whether or not you want this person back. Because they, clearly they did break your trust. You know, clearly they denied you in this connection for possibly for some of you years. Okay? But now this person is free from this karmic. And they're coming directly to you to confess how they feel. And for someone, it's going down today. Okay? Okay? This person is about to give you a very, un you're not going to be expecting them to just show up at your door today. They may bring flowers with them. I feel like they're coming to talk to you in person, collective. Okay. Oh, I wanted this deck. I want this one. What advice or information can you give to my collective divine? Advice, intel, let's see. 
yeah here comes this person coming back around and yes they are getting some encouragement from someone in their inner circle it could be a friend or a family member they're being encouraged to come towards you okay so this person is coming back around all right Ooh, that one flipped up i feel like you think this isn't for you you know Yep, you're ready for something new. Ooh, collective, get ready for this. You are not prepared for this, okay? Yeah, you're ready for something new. Um, you've completed this cycle, man. You're sick of the stagnancy. You're sick of no forward movement, right? It's time to go. So this is you moving on, okay? There's those, these are those stairs, right? And um, where is it? And there you go. It's the same thing. You're, you're um, closing out a cycle here. You may already think it's over. I'm telling you, I feel like you already think it's over. But this person, the one who left you behind, sitting there feeling orphaned, they are coming back around. Here they come. Okay? So get ready. This is faded communication that's about to happen. Okay. And with an eight here, this is your person coming back around. Okay. Anyway, my beautiful collective, that's what I have for this reading. I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you like this vibe, right? Join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.